Yo, what up, everybody? It's your boy. Actually, I got nothing in the building. Live from Kailasa, aka Mr. Drunk on Sadashiva. You need to get over here and be on that. And I got my garba on. So check it out. Y'all need to come over here and see this new building that's getting put up. It's amazing how fast they're doing it. Like, word, I just went inside the extension building just for a coffee for like 30 minutes. There was no roof on the building. I came outside, I was like, where that roof come from? You know what I mean? Yo, it's like Sadashiva's thousand hands are just going all over the place and it's getting built up quick. So you need to get over here. Every day it's getting more live and more live and more live. Bigger completion, bigger completion, bigger completion. They're gonna need to drop a beat behind me just to <laughs> express what I'm saying right now. Cause the whole experience is like a divine Leela, divine play, divine song, whatever you want to call it. It's amazing. <laughs> all right. And public service announcement for all the Canadians who are like me and who have always been wondering how I can bypass winter. Come to Sadashivo Hum. It's warm, it's powerful, and it's that dopeness. All right. We're going to come here through. No more cold, no more slipping on ice, no more doing one of these to try and walk to where you're going. No more having to avoid hail going inside your eyes. Like, oh my God, my eyes, my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> and when you come back from Sadashi Boham, your third eye will be open. You'll be able to shut your eyes and walk no matter where you're going. <laughs> I'll tell you right now, getting hail in the eye hurts. It sucks. But third eye manifestation, that is the best thing ever. Fills you with bliss, joy, and power. I love it. <laughs> and for all the people that I'm causing that keep telling me, oh, I went to Nithyanan Doham. I don't need to go to this one. I went to Inner Awakening. I don't need to go to Sadashi Voham. Stop telling yourself that you don't need the best after the best after the best after the best. Okay, it's okay to have the best things in life. Some of you will give you all that and more. <laughs> it's like you saying, oh, I had fresh food for breakfast yesterday, so I'm gonna eat out the dumpster today. Why? Why are you doing that to yourself? Come beat the Bhagasastras. And when you're over here, not only are you going to be eating the Bhagasastras, you're going to be eating power, okay? That's what we eat in Kailasa. We eat powers. That's how we become Sadashiva. That's how you're going to get enlightenment plus the Garba. <laughs> and straight up, powers is the best thing for breakfast. Cheerios ain't got nothing on this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And when you're in here, just you feel so amazing. Like, the food tastes better than, I remember we went to go donate blood, and when I was in Canada, I wasn't eating bananas, but me and bananas did not go too well. So I came over here, and I'm just like, I'm like a mini bananas, 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 I love it. So <laughs> we went to go donate some blood, and because you, when you do that, you gotta replenish your glucose or something like that. They gave me a best stack of bananas, I'm like, sick! So I started eating it, I'm like, uh, why? You know, it didn't taste the same as it does in Kailasa. Why? Because Swamiji's here. He makes everything better. And in Sadashiva home, he's going to be radiating every single place you go. Go to the tree, Sadashiva. Go pick up your garba, Sadashiva. Put on your clothes, Sadashiva. Everything, Sadashiva. Just do it. It's the best thing for your life. <laughs> and... If you don't have a garba, you need to go find a friend who has a garba. Go to a Vedic temple right now and go find one and see how you can manifest Sadashiva Hum in your life. And if you're planning on not, not going, you need to slap yourself. And then, <laughs> and then go to the Atma Morti and bow down to it. If you don't have an Atma Morti, bow down to your Atma Lingam. If you don't have an Atma Lingam, what are you doing with your life? Come to Sadashiva Hum. I'll tell you right now, if you don't have well, at least one of those, if not all of those, you are slipping heavy. You slipping like you on black on ice. You look like you want black ice in Canada with the subarctic winds and the ice storms. And I've been in that. It's not fun, dude. Come to India, Bangalore, Adi Num. We don't have ice storms over here. 
We only have power manifestation storms. Become a god. Strike. All right. Uh, one more thing to send it off is... This is the best place to be. It's the only place to be. You have literally taken birth during this time period only to be here. If you don't come here, you might as well just go lock yourself in the closet and don't come back out until you're ready to pay for Sadashi Voham. <laughs> <laughs>